In the Carolina Kitchen today, fresh from the Fire on the Rock competition dining series, we have chef and owner of Strada Italiano, Anthony Serrato is here. Welcome, and you were actually one well, of the you. first two chefs to compete this year. Yes, it was uh, uh, me and uh, Chef Sam from uh, Ratchet from uh, um, a Vidalia restaurant uh -huh. and wine bar in Boone, in Boone. He's a really nice guy. I got a chance to really get together and talk a little bit while we were cooking, and it was really great. The whole experience there is just amazing. And let me tell folks, first of all, tell us what you're going to make for us today, Well, this and is I'll one explain how the competition kind of works once you do that. Since I started this Italian food, authentic, fine Italian cuisine, but... Uh, uh, there, I got a chance to play with some different things. So we, oh. we're doing a little Indian dish today. It's uh, Brussels sprout and carrot pakoras, mm. which is in a chickpea flour. It's something that we do a lot of gluten-free stuff at our restaurant. So I wanted to do that to, at the uh, uh, competition yesterday. And then they had uh, the local ingredients were uh, shrimp from. Uh, I'm probably going to butcher this name, but it's Wanchi Wanchesi. Okay, uh, so it's North Carolina company. shrimp, though. Yeah, it's from Roanoke <laughs> Island. Yeah. Uh, like nice pink shrimp, uh, really. Uh, Full flavor, mild, uh, like uh, iodine and all that. It's not like very seafoody. Let me tell yeah. folks what he's talking about too, because on this competition series, it's a got to be NC competition, and that means they give you two surprise ingredients that are from North Carolina, either the fresh caught North Carolina shrimp, or you had another item. The what other was your one, other item? Yeah, it was Thunderstruck uh, Coffee Porter from Highlands Brewery. So um, it's something that is made or produced here in the state, yes. and then they have to use it in every one of the courses. Yes. Uh, well, the way it works is you use two of the items. You get two items, and two of them have to be in one in uh, each each dish uh, uh -huh. for two dishes, and then uh, you can use one item for just one dish. Gotcha. So with okay. the dessert, shrimp wouldn't really go well. So we. I was going to say, how lucky. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> it was definitely a challenge. Just put it that way. So you're grating so, some zest there. Yeah, we're doing a little lime zest right now okay. with um, for the shrimp and the coconut milk. Mm -hmm. uh, then I'm going to add a little salt and uh, sea salt and. Um, uh, paprika, a little smoked paprika. Yum. To marinate the uh, uh, the shrimp. Wonderful. And now the thing is, is also he got all this information yesterday at 11 o'clock, and then you had to serve people at 6 o'clock last 12 night? 12 o'clock. 12 yes. o'clock. Yeah. And okay. That's, yeah, okay. we had to be done by 7. So it's not a whole lot of time to pull this off, but that's why they're picking the best of the best chefs in our region. And so this is coming together beautifully. And you know what's also great is you have the chance to be a judge in this competition dining series, and we have a link for the tickets if you want to get those, because the audience, the, the guests who are dining with you, rate the dishes. And, yes. and they, they were pretty pleased with what you had to offer, weren't they? Yeah, it was a lot of fun. Uh, we're not moving on to the next uh, round, but, um, but I had a great time, and I really support the, uh, uh, the cause because they actually do, uh, some of the proceeds go towards... Uh, uh, the uh, 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 Wednesday Wednesdays at the uh, Mission. That's the, uh, welcome, table. the welcome Table. That's a wonderful yeah. event because so local really restaurants like you and others come in and actually um, serve a wonderful meal to people in need. And that's down uh, through the Hayrick Congregation. We have information yeah. about them as well on our website. So we're searing these off. Yeah, and Jimmy Crispin really I mean, puts his heart and soul into it. It's just really a great experience. All the product is like high quality. Mm -hmm. uh, there's, there's Anything you can wish for is in their, in their cooler, ready for you to uh, just create something really great. Oh my goodness, that smells amazing. Mm. Oh, so while that's cooking so over there, we're going to add some warm water to this. And that's the, uh, the chickpea flour. Chickpea flour okay. with uh, Indian spices. The recipe's online. Absolutely. So. He's sharing this recipe with us. Isn't that awesome? And that's just coming together really quickly. Yes. Do I need to turn these over for you? No. Okay. It's okay. <laughs> oh, it smells so good. I'm, I'm sorry. I'm being absorbed by here. I'm going to smell amazing after this session here. Okay, so this. Yeah. what are we looking for when you're mixing this together? This is just uh, just a, a little consistency to get this fried up together uh, real okay. quick, like a little batter. Type. Gotcha. Okay. Yeah. So what was the hardest thing about last night's competition? You know, um, I was feeling a little under the weather, to be honest with you. Uh-oh. So uh, that was the hardest part of it. Just, just trying to get everything pushing motivated. through and pushing making sure. It. Yeah. Okay. So and this is the uh, cores. We just add all this in here. Wow. And this is going to get fried up. And shredding 20 pounds of carrots mm -hmm. by hand. That was pretty hard. All right. Well, I'm going to let you <laughs> yeah. keep this going and get that ready to fry. Here's how you all can get the instructions or the directions for this wonderful recipe. Oh, it smells amazing. Go to our website, WLOS.com. Click on the Carolina Kitchen link. And you can also find this on Pinterest, and you'll get all the information you need there. The competition dining series lasts for the next several weeks, and we're dropping some yummies in the fryer. There it goes. Chef Anthony Serrato from Strada Italiano, thank you so much for sharing the fun you had 
at the Fire on the Rock series. Thank you.